guys and welcome back to the channel and thanks for joining me for another shave and if you're new to the channel welcome thanks for joining right looking forward to the shave as always brush first today I'm going to be using my Razor Rock 400 if I can get it the right way around you can see that 22mm plus soft knot beautiful brush I've got that soaking now Skeletor soap one of my favourite PAA soaps and it's High Jump 47 it's an absolutely beautiful beautiful scented soap it, it's a high end scent um, like Creed Aventus. It's a scent I would use to go to an occasion like a wedding or a birthday party or, or anything like that. Very cologne. It's beautiful. And the notes in this are brew, branco, amber, bitter orange, bergamot, animalic, musk. And yeah, I've written it down. The musk, it's a sweet, it's a sweet musk. It's absolutely stunning. And it reminds me of uh, Geo of Trump, Trumpers, um, Eucharist, and Taylor Vault Bond Street Platinum Collection in, in the, the, like, a chrome tub. It's beautiful, it's up there. And I've got a bit in there spread around in my copper Captain's Choice Bowl. Fantastic ball, well worth the money and well worth the shipping in my opinion. <coughs> Razor, engine of choice. We're going with the Razor Rock Game Changer 84P, but I've changed the handle. I've put the super grip handle on it off my Razor Rock German 37 slant and that look, look how flat that head is guys and it's a beautiful razor this would make a good daily shaver in my opinion and to compare handles this is the handle that the um the 84 came with and it's the ufo handle both got superb knurling on there guys as you can see but i wanted something i wanted to try the head on a long handle and i think the 84 used to come in this handle before this one and the difference is as you can see the length there guys both grips are superb i just wanted to try it ch change the balance a bit and the length and inside there today we're using the winner blade for the second use i'm going to load that now and i know what you're thinking Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I thought the same thing. So I'm just going to load that up now. Just drop the wrapper in the sink. Fingers and thumbs today, guys. Fingers and thumbs. Right. Just load that in the head cap. There she is, guys. I'm not going to tip it over in case the blade falls out. And what I love about this razor as well, the head on this. No overhang. No overhang whatsoever. And the blade gap. It's really comfortable. It's a really smooth head. No matter what blade I put in it. Right. Let's get lathering. I'll have three flicks of the brush. Thank you. Kim, I've said that for a while. Let's get lathering. I love this bowl. Really light, really comfortable in the hand. Perfect for my, I've got small hands. And it, it's perfect. It's absolutely perfect in the hand. Yeah, you can't get cheaper bowls. And a lot of you might say, oh, you only pay for the name. You pay for quality. You pay for quality as well. Don't get me wrong, there's nothing wrong with 
cheaper versions and everything else I've got them but it just all adds up to the shade on it using good products and there is good products without the price I know that which I'm going to demonstrate that in an upcoming shave this is beautiful just dipping the tips just to add a bit more water but I absolutely love this soap it's beautiful so are you guys doing you okay I hope your week's been going well I hope you have some great smooth shaves as always and tell me what your shaves of the day is guys if you're shaving today please I love hearing them and I've come up with, I've ordered a couple of things from you guys that you've mentioned in your shaves as well. Don't tell the wife. I hope she doesn't watch this. You spent enough money. Because I pay for everything myself. Up to now. This is absolutely the gonads. I know it's probably a bit bright to light, but look at that, guys. That is absolutely perfection, and I'm going to go with that. I'll show you the ingredients after. Wet the old mush. Not long got out the shower. Just got to rehydrate the, uh, the bristles a little bit. Thanks, Mrs. B, for uh, washing the uh, towel straight away. Here we go, guys. Let the water out of the sink. Get a bit of heat in the razor. Now, both handles are made of uh, 316 L stainless steel. Beautiful. Should we lather up first? Get ahead of yourself! Been looking forward to this, guys. I've had nothing but hassle for the last two days. Oh, yeah. Mm. Look at that, that guys. And it's only a tiny bit of the bowl as well. I made sure this time. Beautiful brush, beautiful knot. You can see how it delivers. Nice shine on that. No pre shave today. Get a bit more heat in the razor. And I know what you think, because you use another PAA soap. I'll tell you why. First of all, here we go, guys. First pass with the growth. Gillette Winner Blade, second use. With the Razor Rock Game Changer 84p. Just checking the old uh, side is. I still haven't had an haircut, guys. Still haven't had an haircut. But the ribs are getting better. I'm getting a little bit better every day. Wow, good feedback. No blade chatter, nothing. Beautiful. What's the same? Oh yeah, another PAA So It was Douglas's um, birthday a couple of weeks ago. And Everybody was giving the well wishes on their, on their shaving forums. Oh. They were getting better. Just had a twinge. And um, everybody was giving the well wishes. So I did as well. And I said, just for your birthday, 
still close. I'm going to dedicate the next four weeks of shaves to PAA soaps. Just using their soaps. Just to thank you um, for all the work and everything he's done for us wet shavers. Because I couldn't buy him anything or I could have just sent my well wishes, which is what I did, but just to show my gratitude, I've dedicated the four weeks of shaves to PAA soaps. And not only that, I've been trying so many soaps out, new soaps and everything that I've gotten that Mrs. B bought me for Christmas. I've missed the PAAs and I've missed the tops as well, to be honest with you. The Taylor Bond Street creams was the first decent creams that I ever brought. Uh, brought. <laughs> Number one. When I first started wet shaving and I love tops. So, I'm going to be start using some of the creams as well. I need to start using everything I've got in the den, not just keep buying new stuff. Because we all do it, don't we? We've got that much stuff in our dens. As soon as you buy something new and you see these soaps that you want and everything, I've got to try that and I'll use that. And you forget about all the other gear. Well, I'm going to put that right. And I've got, a, I'm, after these, I've got an upcoming shave, um, which was requested more than once, of, of doing a shave with the very first products that I had with my very first shave, and I've still got them, obviously. I don't throw anything away. So I'll be doing that, that'll be an upcoming shave. And also, there'll be a video coming up, well, it's going to be a bit later now, of the shaved and top. But with breaking the ribs in the car crash, the tour was going to be next week. But obviously, I'm nursing the broken ribs. So that's took priority, and I haven't done a thing with the new den. That's my excuse anyway. Tidy up. Yeah, I hope you've been having some great shapes, guys. I hope your weekend went well as well last weekend. Here we go, guys. Second pass across the grove. This is beautiful. I'm really impressed with the winter blades. And the guy that put me onto them was John Shaves 101. I watched one of his videos when he used them. And he waved the bar on. I'm getting some of them. Never look back. Yes, they can be expensive. Yes, there will be a customs charge. Yes, there will be a length of time where you have to wait for them to come from India. But in my opinion, it was worth every penny and every minute, in my opinion. I bought 110 of them. I gave a pack to uh, Paul H. Good friend there. Hey Paul, how you doing? And I gave a pack to another friend and 
colleague, Kevin Shaves. So if you don't know who they are, check the channels out. Kevin Shaves, Paul H and John Shaves 101. I love using this razor. Another good investment to the den. It's a beautiful razor. And I know people, I've done it myself um, with newcomers to uh, wet shave and what razor do we get or anything like that. I've done it myself, I'd recommend the 84C or the um, Edwin Jagger DE89. But I would recommend also either one of these or the, is it the 68, Game Changer 68? I really would. Wow, great second pass. Great second pass. And what's the weather doing where you are? I've been lucky when I, we've had a lot of rain. We've had a bit of sleep, a lot of rain. Um, it's parts of England now, the floods are still carrying on. Um, they've had a lot of snow. And the new guys over the States as well. I, I, I was. Can't stop watching the news on YouTube when they put clips up of the, the, the weather over there. New York, uh, New Jersey, Kim. I, I'm glad you're okay, Kim. That was the, um, what did they call it? The bullseye, bullseye of the uh, winter storm in New Jersey. Three feet of snow overnight, guys. Unbelievable. There's more snow forecast on the way over here in the UK as well and then you got all the floods so everybody that's been affected by all the snow and the floods and everything heart goes out to you guys I hope you're okay you and your families stay safe stay warm don't go out unless it's absolutely vital here we go guys, third pass against the Grove. Yeah, like I said, I hope your week's gone well up to now guys. Mine's been a bit alright, but it's been a nightmare. Yes, I'm off work, I'm still nursing the broken ribs from the car crash. But buying a car now? Unbelievable. You can't just go to a dealership or anything like that and I'm going to look at cars. Oh, you got the keys for this one? I'm going to take it a test drive. And... Nope. None of that now with this COVID, which has added more stress to the crash and not having a car that you've got to replace. You've got to book an appointment to have a test drive. You can't even do that on some of them. You can't even go and have a look at a car. You have to um, request a video of the car which they'll take a video of the car, the inside, the engine, this, that, and other, and everything, so you can have a look at it online. Where's the fun in that as well, Bob? By the excitement. This COVID's taken a lot more from people that we take granted for. And we haven't decided on what car we're getting next. Mind you, we did. We did find the car. Somebody changed their mind. It's got to be a joint decision. But yeah, somebody changed their mind. But now, we're getting phone calls left, right and centre off this salesman. 
in the first car that we, that we were interested in and inquired about. But we've got the hire car, which is being paid for by the other guy's insurance, because it wasn't our fault. Buffering. Works out brilliant, the buffing technique for me, where you don't take the, the blade off your skin. Really good feedback. Great blade. And the balance and the weight and everything with this other handle on the head. Perfect for me. Nothing wrong with the other handle. Absolutely nothing wrong with it. I loved it. It's just that I prefer this. Bit longer, bit heavier. And thanks for Sig for pointing out um, Sig Solo. Um, the noise chatter on the last video, I know what it is. The wife did something to her, because everything's all linked up, she changed something on her laptop. So when she opened up a laptop and connected up to Windows, whatever it was, it opened a few windows if you like and it changed my laptop for some reason I don't understand because I'm not technically minded there we go five minutes on the lift I haven't done that for a while I'm enjoying it though and when I exported the uh, the video to the laptop it went through one drive and it's done it before but once it's exported and everything else I can't do anything about it and I'm trying to figure out how to switch it off or export it through another app not technically minded I might sound it wow sadly isn't that um, so yeah and I I've played around and fiddled, fiddled with it and changed a few settings, so I hope this goes up and everything's okay and there's no noise. I'm sure you'll let me know. But yeah, there's nothing I can do about it, I apologise guys. And it, it, if there is um, noise chatter on this, and if it bear with me, I will get it sorted eventually, even if I have to send the laptop off and try and get it sorted out or whatever. Beautiful. Fantastic feel on the skin with this. It's it's good protection, it's cushioned, it lathers up excellent. And the scent is all the way through the through the shave. Scent's about a seven, seven, eight out of ten. In the pork and on the face. To my nose anyway. Still can't stretch the skin because I don't want to overstretch the uh, the ribs. Well, I am on recovery. The wife, Mrs. B, she's back in work. She's still a little bit bruised, but she's okay. So we're all on the mend. Everything's tickety-boo, apart from getting a new car. <laughs> Could be worse. Could have been dead. I am, well, me and Mrs. B are very lucky, but I took the brunt of the uh, the accident on my side. I've certainly been feeling it the last couple of weeks. slipness on the old chinaroo and it's not CK6 formula by the way I 
got the normal one because if I wanted to add the CK6, I've got it there in the cube. Wow. BBS. Sorry, I forgot to mention the pickle time. Sorry. Got this much stuff in my head that I want to get on with. And I'm only human. Cold water rinse. beautiful you know when you've had a good shave because you the way the towel feels on your skin to me to you to me to you that is beautiful that is beautiful change today we're going with Theus unscented today Used Thayus for a while, I haven't used any wood chisel for a while because I love the Allen block. I love the feel of the Allen block once it's applied. Oh, it's beautiful. No nicks, no weepers or seepers. Superb. And while that's going off just a tad, I'll let this go off and I'll just go through what I've used. So, Phoenix Artists and Recruitments, PAA, High Jump 47, fantastic scented soap. It's, it's a cologne soap and it's, it's a special scent to me for a special occasion and everything like that. And the Branco ingredients in this, in this uh, sorry, note is a tree resin or sap if you like from the amazon and the animalic the alamanic musk in it apparently the top perfumers in brazil use it in their perfumes and aftershaves and there's the ingredients guys you can see that if you want to pause it and it's coke and butter beautiful absolutely beautiful soap if you like cologne scents and everything, we use the Captain's Choice Bowl, the Copper Captain's Choice Bowl, fantastic bowl. We use the Razor Rock, if we get it the right way round, Razor Rock 400, 22 mil plus off knot, beautiful knot, and you can see how it delivered. Quite a bit still left in there, but I'll be anything in the bowl. Clean all that up after. We had that soaking in the uh, Skeletor. We used the Razor Rock 84P with the Super Grip handle, not the UFO handle. Nothing wrong with that. I prefer that, but that will get put back on here and this will go back on your slant. Beautiful, beautiful razor. Great, positive, comfortable feel. Maneuverability, absolutely no problem. It was beautiful and it's made of, and the both handles are made of uh, 316L stainless steel. And inside there, soggy wrapper because I dropped it in the sink, it was the, oh, here we go, the winner blade. It's all soggy. The winner blade for its second use, it was beautiful. And then after that, we used the Thayer's Witch Hazel Unscented. Beautiful stuff. And to finish the shave off, we have the matching star jelly. High jump 47 PAA. Make sure the top's on. Twist the top to activate the pump. And 
Come on. There we go. Pea size. That's all you need. Wow. I love the scent. I want to go splash. But it's a bit more expensive. And I put a big order in. I have to watch the budget. I've got to watch the budget even more now with the new car. Don't know if I'm going to be buying anything for a while, but we'll see. That is absolutely beautiful. That's the star jelly. After shave and balm in one. Fantastic. So that is a banging shave. Banging shave. And that's it guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Uh, it's, it's been a pleasure. <laughs> um, God, that's a banging shave. It feels great. Thank you so much for your new subscribers as well. Thank you for jumping on board of this madhouse. And yeah, that's it guys. Thank you so much for all your support and everything else. I'm loving absolutely the whole thing. I'm still loving it as much as I did when I first started. And it, it, it's down to you guys as well. Um, it's a passion, not an obsession. See you on the next shave, guys. And whatever you do, stay safe and stay warm. I'll see you then. Bye for now.